Good morning everybody and welcome to Cafe Cagliari Training Center. Today we'll be focusing on maintenance and cleaning routine. I know that it might sound boring, although it's quite necessary. Cleaning routine that every barista should have is very important in order to use your coffee devices at their best capacity and also to improve the final taste in your cup. Today, I'm gonna show you a few tips of a daily and weekly routine. The first thing that we look after our espresso machine is our group handle. So we unlock the group, you can empty the basket, and then with the help of this tiny object here, which is a hook, I would say, or even a teaspoon or a blind filter, we get the filter out of our group handle. By doing that, we can already see how dirty it gets inside and all of that coffee remains, all of the coffee that's already been extracted will just corrupt the taste in our final cup and we don't want that. So what I usually do is give it a good rinse with hot water from the machine. You don't need to waste that much time in this process. You can just give it a good rinse with hot water and make sure you rinse the back of your filter as well, especially the spouts, because that old coffee will make your espresso taste worse than what it should. After I've done that, I usually get a container or a very, very big pitcher like this one. I fill it up with hot water from the machine and then I just let the group handle and the filter itself sit in there for at least a couple of minutes. While our gear is soaking up in hot water from the machine, we can look after our group heads as well. And what I usually do is I get this tiny circle brush here that I use to get rid of the coffee remains that's stuck in our group heads walls. And how to do that is to move the brush circularly, just like that, and gently. As you can see, you have some coffee remains falling down your tray, and this is what you want to get rid of because they all corrupt your next extractions. What I do next is I start backwashing our machine. You can get a spare group handle, any group handle will do. We'll plug it in and then we'll start backwashing. Every machine works differently, it will take just a few minutes and this is the routine that I would recommend daily, especially after a huge workflow. What about a weekly routine? I would definitely recommend using some cleaning products, espresso machine cleaner, any type would do. You won't need much either, you need just a teaspoon of that and you want to use it inside your pitcher here with your gear and also during the backwash. You want to do the backwash with a blind filter instead of a normal filter with a, a teaspoon of product inside and that will do just fine. What about your steam wounds though? Because we want to look after those as well. They've been steaming milk all day. So what I usually do is I get another pizza, fill it up with hot water from the machine, and then I'll just let the steam wounds sink in there. Maybe give it a few flush. There are some products out there for steam wounds as well. I'm not a huge fan of those. If you keep your cleaning routine consistent enough, you can just use hot water and that will do just fine. 